I don't know how good my connection's going to be. Oh, a little thing fell off. We have a squirrel up there. We have people putting up decorations, of course. The connection's gonna go in and out, it seems. So this is Atlantic Beach. Some of the decorations. I'm gonna be using this platform for all kinds of things. We can talk conspiracy, learn how to make colloidal silver, Bible and scripture, of course. And since this is my first outing, I don't have the dog, but Maya will be coming with me. And I have no idea how this looks and sounds to anybody. I, I'll have to watch it later. A little bit of decoration there. I got inspired by the walking shows I was seeing on YouTube. Tree full of oranges. Or tangerines. In this house, black lives matter. Science is real. No human is illegal. Goodness. They're so diluted. It's not too cool. Probably around, let's say, 50s. People from New York are coming down buying these houses up. I've got floppy shoes on too, so you'll hear my feet. That's a no-no in live walks, I hear. So we might make it to the beach before the sun comes up. I've always loved this tree right here. It's huge. It's a heritage tree, I didn't know that. That's pretty neat. It's old though, it's huge. This is the canal that runs behind the house. A lot of wildlife activity. We get coyotes, raccoons, not counting the birds. The connection seems to be holding now. little fire pit going on over here. The sky looks gorgeous other than the chemtrail nastiness.
a little pretty tree there. Not sure what that is. Oh, it's a rose bush. They just let that rose bush grow. I'm using a Hoem H O H E M gimbal. I'm not using the app that came with it. Little decorations over there. Doesn't seem to be a lot of decorations there. I see something blinking. I'll do a more thorough Christmas walk at dusk. They have all the lights on. Got his shed lit up. One reason I started these walking videos, or I'm going to start doing more walking videos, is exercise. That's why you don't have to worry about a flood at mom's house. There's so many deep canals that if the big ocean did come in, it'd have a long ways to go to get to our house. Nobody at the beach. That's all the parking areas. I've been going to do this for like three days, but the wind's been ridiculous. 20, 30 mile an hour winds. I got this palm tree. There's a Santa with a surfboard up here somewhere. I'll find him in a minute. It's just a sandbox. Nice little place. It's a multi. Here's the Santa. Oh no, that's the snowman. The Santa's on the next block. Florida style. Kind of cool. He put some thought into it. He's an Eagles fan. He's the one with the Santa on a surfboard. Not on a surfboard, beside a surfboard. He's a Jaguar fan, too. I guess they have a little mixture in there. These are cute. Definitely gonna walk down here at night at some point. They usually do. That's a Santa. It's 
very cool. That we're just gonna do a little peek and then we're gonna head to the beach. Hopefully get the sun coming up. The luminaries are happening last night. That's why those things were all over the place. Shoes off. We got somebody down here checking out the beach. taking pictures. Oh yeah, we got a good sunset, sunrise, sorry. Look at there. No wind today, it's gorgeous. Not cold at all, not to me. Oh, and the tide's out and the ocean's a lot calmer than it was the other day. Thank you, Jesus, for the beautiful day and all your blessings. I live on paradise on earth and I don't take nearly enough advantage. Look back up the coast. Back towards there is Atlantic Beach Town Center and Ocean's Eleven Hotel. These are all the houses lined up. I'm turning it north, and that's back towards Mayport, St. John's River. Connection seems to be holding up. Yeah, 
cold the water is. Got a lot of sudsies. <laughs> Pelicans are out there feeding. Uh, I'd say the water is about 60 maybe. Really churned up. Yeah, it's about 60. Maybe the 50s. I should get out here every single morning, which I will start doing more. I'm gonna get me a whole business going, showing people how to take care of themselves without relying on the man. And talk about God, talk about conspiracy theories, like Hillary Clinton playing the face off of a poor baby. Let's not talk about that though. I'm not ruining my walk this morning with those thoughts. I spend enough time there. Yeah, the waves are gorgeous this morning. If it was warm, it's perfect for swimming. Though I do see a few riptide places. people that do this in New York, Canada, I see them walk for like three hours doing nothing but filming. And the whole time, people are like giving them super chats, five bucks at a time just for the views. I'm like, well, yeah, I could do this. They're building one over here or repairing one, I'm not sure which. Got the whole roof off of it. Start to pack in a little bit with the joggers and the walkers. You're welcome, Russell, anytime. I'm at least gonna do two or three a week. I'll be hitting like St. Augustine, different areas, surrounding areas. Appreciate you watching. I wasn't sure how it was gonna work, like people just pop in or I'm gonna upload it to YouTube and Patreon and Parlor. Geez, I'm on every social media now. Ever since July and I found out about Q. researching the heck out of them. There's a sandpiper. Look, wrong way. Getting in some breakfast. Or she. <laughs> They're not afraid.
with a long beak on that thing. It's probably a three inch beak on that little bird. getting that white glue. Let's see if I can catch some ospreys. They out there fishing too. Yeah, back towards the north it's pretty cloudy looking. North Carolina getting rain and we might get some later. I'm not sure. I don't even watch the news and weather. Half the time they're wrong anyway. My brother John in Texas will enjoy this too. I know a few people that will, and the grandbabies. And it's fun. We're fixing to do a UE. I let Maya shut up in the bedroom with Bun Bun, which is okay. Bun Bun and Maya get along good and Bun Bun's in her cage. But they both have separation anxiety. I actually have a little cage that I can bring Bun Bun on my shoulder. So once I get used to holding this thing and operating everything, I'll put Bun Bun in her little carrier cage on my shoulder and Maya fastened to my belt loop. And then we'll all three go walking. Yes, it is. I actually used to sun gaze. It's not bad for you. You gotta do it like in the first, I'd say 30 minutes when the sun rises. You get some really psychedelic effects and it doesn't hurt the eyes. In fact, it's supposed to heal the eyes. But I haven't studied that enough to recommend it. I wouldn't tell somebody to go gaze at the sun. I know very well you don't wanna do it when the sun's up above the horizon. Basically, you're doing it as the sun comes up. And putting your bare feet on the ground 20 minutes a day is healing. You know, you've heard of it too, Russell, huh? I enjoyed it. I used to be the opener at Panera. And that's what I did before the store opened. I'd sit on my scooter and look at the sun. This is a gorgeous area of Jacksonville anyway. I wouldn't want to live anywhere else. You can go further down to St. Augustine and areas like that, but to me, well, the beaches are prettier down there, but as far as the shells aren't all beat up. When you get up this far north, the shells are all messed up. You can see there's very few shells. And when you do find them, they're like beat all to pieces. I'll show you the shells area. Tide's going out, so lots of beach to walk on. That was a dog in a boat. It's like a kayak with a backpack in it. And there's just not any shells around at all. 
I don't know where all the shells went. Usually there's a bunch of broken up ones. That's about the best I can find right here. Yeah, very low tide. It's going out as we speak. It's a beautiful Sunday though. I'm glad I got out here this morning. She got her a comfy spot with her little puppies. That's grandpa and grandson. He was taking pictures a while ago. I hope that's what it is. As wicked as the world is, I wonder anymore about everything, which is terrible but the kid looks happy. All right, we're back at the entrance to where I walk back home. Might as well take y'all all the way back to the house too. I say y'all, me and you. <laughs> but later there'll be y'all viewing because I'm gonna be posting it everywhere. It's my introduction video, sort of. This is where the calves start burning. Ah, sand. <laughs> okay, I'm up the hill. That's pretty. Excuse me. I'm going to conclude. Thanks, Russell, for joining. Talk to y'all later.